Masjid Alaman Mosque was originally built in 1985 and just completed its 20-year construction process and now amplifies its azan or call to prayer. This is the mosque's religious leader, the Imam, performing one of the five daily prayers reaching the ears of people within a 20-block radius. When moving into a neighborhood, the first thing Muslims look to do is build a mosque. East New York, in Brooklyn, is home to more than 2,000 Bangladeshis, many of whom practice Islam. Calling to prayer for Muslim five times a day is no-brainer. It's, it's an absolutely necessity, and that's what we're doing. It is our right. The Hazan happens five times a day, lasting up to two minutes each, starting right before sunrise and ending right before sunset. They have to have some consideration for us. It's too noisy, too, too noisy. You don't get used to it because you have no idea when it's going to happen. The yeah, Azan started five months ago. Okay. It's right. We started with Azan and people came in more. It's not singing. Though it is melodious, it is very, very soothing sound. It doesn't disturb anybody if you, if you listen to it and if you know the meaning of it. It is a, a call to the prayer from the God to his creation, simply calling every believer, every, every faithful to come and pray, worship your God who created you. It, it's saying, Allahu Akbar means God is great, come to prayer, it's time to prayer. It is better to pray than not to pray, but it's, it's just a simple reminder. Oscar lives 20 blocks away from the mosque, and he also thinks the Hazan is too loud. For instance, I go to church. Worship is at one o'clock. I already know that. I don't need a bell to remind me. 156 complaints total, reported and filed by the NYPD regarding Masjid Alaman Mosque. 911 people call, noise department come in. I explain to them because he say I give the ticket. I say give me the ticket. I go to fight in the court. Even religious institutions have guidelines to meet with noise codes set by the Department of Environmental Protection. And so an engineer comes, they take the reading when there is no amplified sound and when there is amplified sound, and then they identify whether or not it is in violation of the noise code. Turn down the decibels. Too loud. Do it for their audience. Do it for their congregation. We don't need to hear it up at Atlantic Avenue. The DEP requested that the mosque lower their morning calls to prayer and decided not to find them because of the short duration of each hazan. There's a lot of complaint against, against the hazan, and there's a lot of people favor. We ask some people, they really love them because they've been in America so long, never had a chance to uh, hear their hazan to come to mosque time to prayer. Oh. This is Tadia Toussaint reporting from New York City.